Good morning. Today I will be talking about our process <coughs> design, which is uh, producing ethanol from switchgrass. My team members are Brad and Brian. Brief overview of what this presentation will cover. We'll have a problem statement to begin, provide a little bit of background, an introduction to our process, then uh, discuss more about the stages of our process, provide specifications and parameter selections, give a description of the process modeling and the ChemCAD simulation software, describe the economic analysis, and give a summary. So our problem statement is as follows. We have to develop a plant process converting switchgrass feedstock into a nearly pure ethanol product. And we are supervised by Dr. Henry and Charles Sanford. We'll be presenting this final report to the board of directors on the 25th of April. This report will include a finalized process flow diagram, equipment design, economic analysis, and unit optimization. So a little bit of background. As most of us know, ethanol is used primarily as a fuel additive in gasoline. Right now, gasoline can contain up to 10% ethanol. There have been lobbyists that push this uh, up to 15% in the future. This map here shows uh, ethanol biorefineries in the United States. Most are located in the Midwest, though there is a couple in Tennessee as well. Uh, most of the ethanol is produced from corn. This graph here shows the uh, ethanol production over the past 30 years. The graph starts in 1980 and goes to 2012. In the last decade, the, the production of ethanol has <coughs> increased dramatically. But for our process, instead of using corn, we decided to look at switchgrass. Uh, some advantages of switchgrass is increased soil conservation, and this is important because it keeps the, um, keeps the chemicals and minerals from fertilizer that are put into the soil, helps retain them so they're not lost as quickly. And this switchgrass also has a lower effect on the food market than corn. It does not completely negate the effect of the food market because switchgrass is still used for a livestock feed and things like that, so that has an effect on uh, beef prices but it is lower than corn. So for this design approach, we based it on research. We did not conduct experiments of uh, converting switchgrass into ethanol. Instead, we found research online of methods that have been used before. I performed mass and energy balances on these processes using uh, chemical equations. I also used uh, CAD simulation software to help us as well. And some of the technical background that Brad will be covering, the switchgrass pretreatment stage, gasification, syngas fermentation, and purification. 